Hey, what's up, guys? Crispy Bacon Wizard here. Some more Red Dead Redemption 2. Got a prize Tuesday stream. I usually don't stream on Tuesdays, but I didn't have anything else going on. I wanted to play some more Red Dead, so I thought we'd see uh, see what Arthur Morgan get up to now. We're in Chapter 6. I think at the moment I'm in St. Denis, because I had got myself a new haircut. Trimmed up his crazy beard here. You now we got some. I think it's called the. Ah, I forget what it's called now. So we got a Sailor Adler mission here we can do in St. Denis. We might go ahead and do that while we're here. Yeah, it's a good girl. Come on, Oreo. Hope everybody's having a good day. Oh, what? dang, they jumped in the way. <laughs> Are they crazy? Hope everybody's having a good day. It's almost Thanksgiving here in America. But Thursday, you're going to have lots of turkey. Here's the Sadie Adler mission. Is there anywhere to hitch my horse? Alright, Charlie, I'm trying to get out of the way. Cool it. Hey, mister. It's gonna be weird playing another open world game. I ain't gonna be able to talk to every NPC that there is. I'll be like, I want to be one to say, hey, mister. And they won't let me. <laughs> I don't know, that's surprisingly fun just doing that. Like, howdy, fellers. Let's go. Let's go where? And why are you so riled up? Today is a great day, Arthur. Today is the day they are going to hang Colm O'Driscoll. Uh, so? Either they hang him or I shoot him. Oh, they are gonna hang him. Yeah, and not before time. That boy's been on the gallows more than most. I wouldn't count anything until his neck's broke. Well, nor would I. Which is why, despite us being wanted men, we're gonna attend the event ourselves. Well, and follow him on to the scaffold? Well, let's hope not. But if I could see that son of a bitch breathe his last, I think I'd die a happy man. We are gonna disguise ourselves in this, <laughs> in this. Well, that's a good disguise. Just a hat and a coat. <laughs> oh, lawman, huh? How come that coat okay. look black? Come on. Was that the inside, I guess? Well, don't we just look the part? We'll cut through the alley to get to the gallows. We keep our weapons holstered, our disguises on, and our wits about us. Mrs. Adler, might I say, being a fancy woman of Saint Denis shoots you. <laughs> I dress up like the Queen of Sheba if it makes sense. That's not too well. Son of a bitch sway. Colm hung me up, nearly butchered me. I don't mean I'm comfortable in this woolen coat. You hey, what's up? Uh, how remember, you doing? Mr. Morgan? XX? So lucky. What do I call you, man? Your husband. I lost my darling Annabelle. That poor boy, Kieran. We've all lost something because of Colm. And that is why we will shepherd him to eternity. Amen to that. Keep those fingers off those triggers, cause we'll need cool heads and calm dispositions to see this done. Oh, Cervantes. Hey, what hey what's preach, up, man? Brother. How you been? Whatever do you mean? Are you gonna keep your cool? Really? When you seem to lose it all so often huh. now. This doubting and questioning of yours, I've missed the I old, miss the old Dutch. Don't we all? Can you two quit it? Y'all got a job going to do. crazy. We're all in rough agreement about how we're doing it, as far as I can tell. Exactly. We'll get it done, all right. All right, then. Come on. We got to hang in the woods. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, I'm doing pretty good myself, man. Been having a really good time with Red Dead here. I'm in Chapter 6. I'm getting near the end. Look here. Don't the public love an execution? 
Let's see, try to see Colm O'Driscoll paying here. Well, something crazy happens. Who knows? Hey. All right. Good. Now, you see that pair of assholes? <laughs> sure. They're Colm's boys. Yes, I think so. What a surprise. I'm glad we're here. What are they pointing Something on at? the roof, I guess. I don't know. We gotta follow them and find out. Yeah. Oh, here comes somebody. <clears throat> Stay here. Don't do nothing. Oh, yeah, this is a really good game. It looks amazing. Go brush that horse, officer. <laughs> yes, sir. Go brush that horse. The crowd came to see a show. We don't want to disappoint them. I guess they did miss their chance to see John swing by his neck. Hey. Hey. You know I wasn't going to let it come to that. Well, I guess I don't know what I know no more. And I guess this isn't the time to question either my decisions or yours. Here and now, Colm O'Driscoll's going to get his due. He's turned down there. We're disguised at the law here. It's a really good story, too. I'm really enjoying it. Everything except for what? Chapter 5. I did not like the Quarma stuff. But. What's it look like? A bunch of cops. How many? Enough. So what do you think? Paul's up on the roof. And once he starts shooting, we have to have our wits about us and move fast. Yeah. I guess we faced worse than this before. Sure. Oh, well, he didn't say sure like Arthur does. Sure. So, they got a guy up on the roof overlooking the gallows. Find a way up there on one of these verandas, through a building maybe, and get him. And do it silently. Well, obviously, I'm gonna do it silently. I wanna see this bastard swing. No, oh, I guess this was not the right way. Oh, that's where this is where we did the art thing. All right, before. Find a way up to the roof and stop him. I'll go back to Mrs. Adler. Quiet, Arthur. Oh, dang. Your boss is gonna swing, I promise. Oh. Say. Today, justice catches up with him. <laughs> As well you may. 
I've been a bad man. Silence! These charges... This is not a court where you shall be tried. This is a place where your sentence is to be carried out. And your sentence, Colmo Driscoll, is that you are to be hanged by the neck until you are dead. This is not a task we take lightly. It is not a task <laughs> we enjoy, but it is a task we must carry out if our civilization is to prosper. Gentlemen, are we ready? Call Modrisk. May God, in his infinite wisdom, have mercy upon your soul. Go calm. Whenever you are ready. Dang old Driscoll. Now you know how it feels to watch somebody you love die. You ruined my life. Oh dang, right there in the not the hell, Sadie. Oh, I got it. Dang. So he went. I think that's hat again. Come on. How do you do that? Crazy? I mean, she has it out for him though. But they kill, killed her husband and I think pretty much assaulted her. Let's just get out of here. In the beginning, so. She doesn't like the Driscolls very much. Damn! <laughs> that was cool. Hey, so Cervantes, you already beat this game, man? Hopefully, if you're watching the Chapter 6 stuff here with me. Alright, we're back at our cave camp we took from that other game. The Mulfred. Mulfred? Mel something like that. Mumfred. How you get on, Arthur? Well, we saw the bastard hang okay, but the whole thing ain't gonna save us. I guess that's one less thing to worry about. I guess compared to the entire government, <laughs> in the end, Como Driscoll didn't seem like such a worry. A letter came for you. Oh, okay. I know it's from that Mary. Mary? She ain't worth it, Arthur. Who is? Uh, sent back the ring. My dear Arthur, you never showed up. And now, after looking at the newspapers, I understand why. I don't imagine you'll receive this letter, but I nonetheless must send it. Arthur. Oh, Arthur. I was just starting to dream the silliest and softest of dreams. I miss you, and I will always miss you. But I cannot live like that. And it seems you cannot live any other way. When I'm with you, the world makes sense. But when we are apart, I see clearly that your world is not 
a world from which one can escape. I'm so sorry for everything. For everything long ago and for starting up that business again. There's a good man within you, Arthur, but he is wrestling with a giant. And the giant wins time and again. You've broken my heart again, and I fear I have broken yours. And for that, I will never forgive myself, but you must let me go now. I enclose a ring you gave me many years ago when we were both young. Not because I don't like it, but because I care for it far too much and it reminds me too much of you. I hope one day you will find some people in love who can use this. For it kept me thinking of you all these years and I hope by returning it to you, I can finally be free. Goodbye, Mary. Mary, huh? I figured. She was trying to get him to leave the gang and run off. Third time looking. Yeah. Wanted to make sure I'm alright with this. I was saving all my auto slaves. Auto save spot. Hey, Uncle. Mr. Morgan. Mr. Morgan, you don't look very well. Uh, I'm not, Reverend. <coughs> I fear I'm pretty sick. I'm so it's sorry. Tuberculosis. You seem well, on the other hand. Yes, sir. I've stopped all that silly business. I think I'm okay. Well, that's wonderful news. <laughs> How? I don't know. I met a Catholic lady, a nun, and we prayed, and it was lifted. The curse was lifted. Good. I can't believe it. Really, I can't. All those years I wasted. What is happening here, Mr. Morgan? You okay? You okay? You seem nervous. Well, of course I'm nervous. This is a nightmare. We'll work something out. Well, yes. All right, then. Hey, Javier. Hey, Arthur. Can we talk? I don't have much to say to you right now. Oh. Guess I'll leave you okay. to it, then. Sure, Arthur. He's not even with me. He's like all on Dutch side. And he's like, we just need to be loyal. Where's John and Abigail? Where's Tilly again? Hello, Tilly. Hello, Arthur. You okay? All this whispering and walking on eggshells, I hate it. I know, but that's how things are right now. Don't know what to do with myself around here. That's Abigail. I don't like this, Arthur. Always good to see you. Hey. Hello, Arthur. I don't want to talk anymore to her. Hey, big man. Or John. Really oh, no, uncle's trying to talk to me. <laughs> me too, uncle. What's going to happen, you know? To everybody. Yes, folks is gonna make a choice. Whether they live or die. And you? I don't have that choice no more. I'm just trying to help others see clearly. That's my choice. You're a good man, Arthur Morgan. Good man. Place is busting in two. Reckon so. 
Remember what I said up at the bridge. When the time comes. I will. Because it's coming. Well, I suppose I should be getting on. Be strong. Yeah, we still have the same time. Hey there. How are you holding up? I'm okay. How are you? You don't look so good. No, I'll be fine. <laughs> what were we spelled wrong, though? Uh huh. So, is there a stew thing I can eat? Pearson was saying, come get it. Oh, look, there's the, the donate thing. Somewhere. Oh, that's the food thing. Do you hear me? Chow is up. This stew is decidedly lacking on decent meat, Mr. Morgan. This should be some real good eating. Let's donate all our food here. Well, uh, it's better than nothing, Pearson. I can always get more. I know supplies are low. All right, I got the food thing. Thank you, Arthur. I don't have any way to donate money anymore. Come on, folks. Let's move to camp. We'll eat some here and drink, and it'll fill up our health scores, stamina, and dead eye. If it's not full, well, dead eye's not full. Get some coffee. He just kind of slid backwards. Hey, y'all. Hey. Hello, Arthur. Right, let me grab a beer. Here we go. Let's have a drink here before we head out on our mission. It's going to be all right. No, it's not. If the Pinkertons don't kill us, we're going to kill each other. Just try to stay calm, all right? Sure, Arthur. <laughs> I just, I just throw the bottles they were. All right, off to the mission now. Chalami's got some kind of mission here. Josiah? I, um, I was, uh... Leaving again? Yes, just leaving. Hey, for good. I'll see you soon. <coughs> Perhaps. Uh, what do you mean? Well, if I was you, I'd disappear too. This is all pretty much over. <laughs> well, I'll be back. No, you won't. Let's not pretend no more. Get out of here. I'll miss you, Arthur. You've been a fine friend to me. No, no let's not get over sentimental. Come on. Place is quiet. Get out of here. You go with my blessing. Thank you, Arthur. Yeah, Arthur's trying to save some people from having to die because the way Dutch is acting. Found a friend looking for you. Mr. Morgan. Sir. How are you? A little better. I hope so. How can I help you? I'm sorry to impose on you again, but I believe I've made progress brokering peace. You have? I believe so. Colonel Favors has agreed to a meeting to discuss and maybe resolve his alleged grievances in mine. Now, he has lied to me more times than I care to remember, but maybe this time he must want peace. 
Why could he possibly want to humiliate us further? Well, we got words for his kind, but they're colloquial. Uh, perhaps I could make one last request. My men are not allowed to carry arms. You want us to keep the peace? Yeah, it'll be a lot of dull talking and ceremony. But I feel with some non-tribe members present, their chances of lying or worse will be reduced. Will you, Arthur? It ain't my business, brother. No, I know. But it is mine. Do it for me. Charles, I got... I've saved your life. Do it for me. <sighs> sure. Sure. You owe this man. You should have him do your negotiation. Let's go. <laughs> Hang on, I need to go change my hat. Hang on. Ah, it's not gonna let me now, is it? No. I'm stuck with what the hats I have on my horse. I should have done that before I talked to Trelawney. Wait up, Charles! Wait up, man. That's the new tad of me. Just hope nobody recognizes me. I've had a few run-ins with the army recently. I wish we could have done more to control the situation. Dutch should not have gotten involved. My son has a mind of his own. Too much so, in fact. I just hope Colonel Favors can be reasoned with. I am not asking for very much, but when our people are sick and hungry, and we find our medicine and supplies are being deliberately withheld. How can we not view that as something personal? When they destroy our sacred sites, how can I convince Eagle Flies and the others that they shouldn't fight back? Maybe that's part of the reason they're doing these things. Because they want you to fight. To be able to say, look, you see how these savages behave? Perhaps. Thank you for helping Captain Monroe to retrieve those vaccines, Arthur. He will be at the meeting and is one person who knows the true situation, at least. I still have hope that we can come to an agreement. And this, the whole the soundtrack is good. Really good. Yeah. Especially some of those key songs, like at the end of the chapters, they're, they're just spot on. Great choices. Stop. Here we are. There's my men up ahead. Hello. Easy. We trust a killer now. Kola with Yumpy. Heel Paul. Unyapi Ktelo. This way.
kind of craziness is going to happen here. Colonel Favors, Captain Munro, we come in peace. Hello again. Who are these two? They're uh, friends of my people. Hmm. Interesting looking fellows. Yeah, they won't cause any trouble. Well, I should hope not. Yeah. Listen, Mr. Uh, <clears throat> Chief. Yes, uh, Mr. I can't uh. say that silly name. Is it? In English, they call me Rain's Fall. Yes, yes, I'm. Uh, I'm sure they do. Well, sure. Listen, we're all Americans here, and we want an outcome. But quite frankly, quite frankly, I am confused. Your men are little more than criminals, in my opinion. <coughs> Keep breaking peace treaties we've made, causing disturbances in everybody's lives. But I pride myself on being a gentleman. Really, I do. But there are limits. So, let me be very... <coughs> you okay, man? Someone. Jax, take him okay. away. Where was I? You're a gentleman with limits? Are you being facetious, sir? Come this way, buddy. I said, are you being facetious, Captain Monroe? No, sir, I am not. Chief Rains. That's, uh, Rains fault. Exactly. Chief Rains, the thing it's quite is, a cough. Sure. Wait here. I'll fetch you some water. I'll, I'll be fine. Thank you. No, no. You know he's going to have Monroe court-martialed. Or attempt to. He's going to make a disgrace of him. Monroe? Seems likable enough for a West Pointer. Why? You know what Favors is like. Because he thinks it's right. Because he thinks Monroe is a patsy. Or a spy. He's convinced he has something to do with those vaccines getting stolen. He thinks Monroe is going to force him into making a concession with the Indians. So he removes Monroe. Removes how? Favors wants him tried for treason and hanged. Why does Favors care about the Indians? Because he doesn't want to back down. I mean, his whole professional life. You know what they say about him. Hightail Favors, the man who missed a battle. Poor Monroe. Kinda liked him. I know. Well, still, he's kinda stuck up. Your men violated the treaty. That treaty is null and void. I have been appointed to negotiate. Feeling better? Yeah. Come on. <coughs> Let's go. Where's that water? <laughs> the lands you currently occupy belong to the United States government. Why is this so confusing, sir? Why? Good day, Colonel Favors. Well, that was remarkably unproductive. <gasps> so? I'm afraid the federal government was quite clear, Colonel, that it wanted peace, and peace for all, and that the treaty had not been broken by anybody. Oh, is that so, sir? And did it want impudence, sir, from a junior officer in public? Was that its plan, too, sir? You insult me. You insult the regiment. Arrest this man. Arrest me? Gross insubordination. Disobeying an order. Treason. Are you mad? You had those vaccines stolen. You disrupted a negotiation. Okay. Let him go. This is all getting out of hand. Hi, Captain Monroe. Let's get out of here. Hi, if I, I were you, I'd keep my mouth shut, amigo. I don't want to kill this man. But shall. Bitch. Charles, Captain Monroe, mount up now. We're getting out of here. Oh, don't be done. What you're doing? You won't get away with this. Yeah. Go, bulls.
got that. Also, I already got that one too. Good job, guys. I heard the conversation going in there, dead out, dead out like this. That took a while. Oh, Couldn't miss him. Be sure as hell don't want to hang around here. Come on, follow me. I actually didn't lose my hat though. Yep. Maybe just shoot it off. Shoot while riding without dead eye. I think we're finally in the clear. Everybody okay? Not really. <laughs> what do we do now? You get out of here. Fast. We'll take you to the station. I can't believe that just happened. I've been an army man my whole life. I heard them talking. They was gonna have you hang for treason. You can't die for those fools. And what about the chief? We'll do what we can. I guess I won't be submitting my <laughs> report. I wouldn't think so. Easy. Captain Monroe. I fear it may be Mr. Monroe from now on. I'm sorry about your career. Here. Here's some money. You take it and get out of here and start a new life somewhere. 
I hear Tahiti's <laughs> nice. Thank you. Just hop on a train to San Denis, jump on a boat, but avoid Guam. Where? <laughs> Meet you back at camp. Mr. Morgan! <clears throat> are you okay? Well, never better. What are you doing here? Well, I'm on my way down to Mexico. They're finally sending me on a mission. Uh. Brother Dorkins is very jealous. <laughs> 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 Man, Arthur is not sounding good at all. What's wrong? Hey, his uh, up. How you doing, man? I'm dying, sister. Arthur's dying. Okay. Yeah, I got TB. I got you it. Get there, buddy. Coughing all over. Beating a man to death <clears throat> for a few bucks. I've lived a bad life, sister. We've all lived bad lives, Mr. Morgan. We all sin. Hey, it's good. But I know you. <laughs> you don't know me. <laughs> Forgive me, but that's the problem. You don't know you. What do you mean? I don't know, but whenever we happen to meet, you're always helping people and smiling. I had a son. He passed away. I had a girl who loved me. I threw that away. My mama died when I was a kid. And my daddy. Well, I watched him die. And it weren't soon enough. My husband died a long time ago. Life is full of pain. But there is also love and beauty. What am I gonna do now? Be grateful that for the first time, you see your life clearly. <laughs> sure. Perhaps you sure. could help somebody. Help him makes you really happy. <sighs> but I still don't believe in nothing. <laughs> Often, neither do I. <laughs> but then I meet someone like you. And everything makes sense. <laughs> You're too smart for me, sister. <sighs> I guess I... I'm afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of, Mr. Bad Morgan. Here. Take a gamble that love exists and do a loving act. All aboard! I shall try. I know you will. I like Arthur. Goodbye. Oh, Arthur. Goodbye, Goodbye, Mr. Goodbye. Morgan. Goodbye. Sister. Adios. Have fun in Mexico. <laughs> I didn't do any things. Kill a pursuer's horse. Oh. They want you to actually kill a horse. It's one of the checklist things. Bastards. I don't want to kill a horse. On purpose. I know it, yeah, I don't want I probably won't do that mission for a goal. There's other missions to, if I decide to do, you have to get 70 gold missions to get a, like one of the achievements. But if I decide to do that one, that won't, won't be one of the 70. <laughs> Alright, should we do a little bit of hunting before we keep going with the mission? I'd like to check off a couple more things on this outfit I need. Let's see, I heard, I'm trying to avoid where, hearing where stuff, like different animals are. But, uh, the island off from that camp we used to have, like right here, I think there's iguanas. Or armadillos or something. No, I don't need iguanas, though. It's armadillos. There wasn't armadillos there. Because that's going to be in the desert. But 
So that never, never mind then. I was thinking I needed an iguana. I need to find a cow, a bull, a boar, an ox, a goat, and two armadillo. And <laughs> legendary Komodo dragon. You're just making up stuff in that game. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta take a, a ding to my honor to get the cow and bull. Uh, Often Australian Shepherd dog. Hey boy, come here! Oh, come here! Oh, don't run off. Ah, there, kitty. Ah, he ran off. There's a cat somewhere too. I don't think he can pet the cat. Hey there, kitty. American domestic cat. So the cows and bulls, I think it counts as animal cruelty to kill them. But there's no wild ones. They're all like in pens and stuff. There's a cowie. It's almost night time. We should just uh, camp. I gotta move away from this town just a little bit. Yeah. Okay then. Make us some uh, minty mutton to eat here. <coughs> Dang, he's not sounding good. I don't even know if there's wild goats either. I don't know, so I'm not sure where to f find. Oh, that's what, what did I do? What time did I sleep to? To midnight. <laughs> Man, it's not gonna let me sleep again. I don't think. Oh, I woke up at midnight and it's storming. Hit the wrong button. You can actually like set up a tent and everything in here in the camp. There's no real point to it. It's just like for just to do it. The uh, Evil Dead. Uh, so uh, yeah, I've seen some of that. I haven't seen much of that, actually, because uh, that's the one with uh, Bruce oh, Campbell, right? My girl. Evil Dead movies. Yeah. Are you talking about, uh, oh, there's like a show too in there. Yeah, I haven't seen that, that show at all. Alright. Oh, there's boars. We can do boars. We also got bounty hunters nearby. We probably want to slow down as I'm getting close. Scare everything off. Hey, so how is it, Huzzah? Do you like it? Yeah, 
we don't need another deer. Here's a Canada goose. Oh, that's uh, the same person made that made the Spider-Man trilogy, Sam Raimi. That's why he does the cameos in Spider-Man. Huh. Yeah, that's cool. I didn't know that. How far am I from my checkpoint? I probably should just go ahead and hop off this horse. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Oh, oh, what animal, what gun do I even need for a boar, though? For, uh, for a check. There's still so many animals I haven't seen in this game. I've seen 81 out of 178. <laughs> There's the boar. Use either a rifle or a bow with poison arrows. Ooh, let's do the bow with poison arrows. The ring announcer in the first Spider-Man. And also, Bruce Campbell was the doorman in that, uh, at that theater that Mary Jane was in the play. That was him. Yeah, we got four poison arrows. Yeah, what? Yep. Yeah, I remember him being that one. I remember that one. I don't remember the ring announcer or the proposal thing. But definitely remember the him being the doorman. Attendant or whatever you want to call it. Pick some more mint. We need to make some more meat. Here. Is that a boar right over there? No, nope, it was just a bush. Oh, it's a deer. It's the bush I saw, though. I thought it was an animal. Bouncer. Ah. <laughs> I don't know. They didn't ever, like, straight up say. But it's like a big fancy place. I don't think they called them bouncers. But it's a fancy, like, off-Broadway play. Fox. The fox over there digging in the mud. So we don't need those animals. So I'm not going to shoot, scare everything. We're looking for wild boars. going this way. We should find us a, a bow or somewhere. We gotta shoot it with a poison arrow. Take that. One shot. One shot to the head. Uh, more deer.
a varmint rifle for that, for that hawk. And we landed right in front of us. I don't have the varmint rifle on me. So anyway. And that'll scare everything that's around off. Whitetail buck. Whitetail deer. Why is there no boar? That's cool. I hawk. I've seen a bald eagle here too. I mean, earlier, like the other day. That's weird. It says this is the right area. Muskrat. It's a little tiny thing. I can't even really see it. Huh. I guess I'm going to head over the, like, down this way. Because there's not one over here. I'm surprised I hadn't scared anything off as close as I am to some of these animals. I'm gonna be very, very quiet. <laughs> See, look at that. That deer's still just standing there. Oh. Spoke too soon. There you go. There you went. And now went my dog Winston this storm. <laughs> yeah, squirrel. Some guy. I don't know what he was doing. I mean nature called and he had to hop off his horse. More deer. Deer. Man. All right. Well, I don't see a boar around here, so we're gonna like go a little faster here and check this area up over this hill. <laughs> he looks funny running crouched like that. Got a pretty good view here. Muskrat. Some deer that are too far away. Deer. A rabbit, but we don't need any more rabbits. That's a, that's a three star rabbit. Some wild horses. Man. The boars are more in like wooded areas, so this is not the right spot. Don't mind me. Carry on. <laughs> well, they did. They just stopped and went back to what they're doing. <sighs> Crap. I think it would be down there in these trees that the boars would be, but there's not. Oh, hell, that's those bounty hunters. Oh, hell. <laughs> Oh, 
Shoot. Let's put this white, this white gray horse. Oh, it's a thorough, dra dapple gray thoroughbred. Oh crap. I guess we're going to go somewhere else. Uh, went into that. So there were no boars here, even though they're on the map. I guess, I guess that's not a guarantee, but that's just an area they usually are. All right, we could uh, head down here and look. Whatever. <laughs> that was a bust. I guess that's how hunting goes in real life sometimes, too. So, whatever. Come on, horse. Let's go. Oreo, come here, girl. Said that. Sounds so silly. We got Bupkus there. Zip. Zero. Zilch. Oh, I think that fishing guy finally showed up. I can go to him in a little bit too. Maybe we can do some legendary fish. That veteran we saved, that uh, his horse ran off with his uh, his wooden leg. We had to get the horse. Oh, I ain't the type. Get oh out damn! Of <laughs> He's like, not the Sharon type. Get out of here! Yeah. Oh, we still got a ways to go. Because we'll want to be quiet once we're getting close. You can kind of hunt from horseback, but it's, you got to make sure you have dead eye, and it's a little tougher. Oh, see, oh there's some freaking boars right there. Let's let them settle down. Let's go ahead and hitch the horse over here. I just scared three off. Poison arrow. All right. Cool. All right. We'll use my cover scent thing because it's going so they won't notice me as easily. They won't be able to smell me. And I see them over there. I see a couple. Let's find a three star one here. Oh, that's a buck. Turkey and a lump muskrat. I hear them. I saw, saw one. Oh, right there. Right, right there. That's the one we need. I 
not that one. What is the one there? That one. And that's his back end. <sighs> so what's up? Oh no, that, let's see, that, that's his head, but there's, let me get a little closer. Alright, well, that should be good. Ah, he freaking turned. too close to that one and scare the other one and scare that one and they'll scare them all off damn he's turned the wrong way I don't want to mess up and hit like a side It's like an ants in his pants. Keep walking back and forth. I can't see for the. Oh, he is facing this way. I got the tree. What? Ah! Oh my gosh. That does not look like it should have been hitting the tree. <laughs> Damn. Oh, <laughs> Where's those arrows? Like you can pick them back up. There's one. There was there is the other. Well, I messed that up. Ugh. I guess from the angle Morgan was, that was hitting the tree, even though it, I could put the dot on the, the bore. So that, uh, not my cover sense wore off. Let's go ahead and use another. Oh, it's not in here. Oh, it's him. Oh, there we go. It just took a second. Kill him. Oh. Oh, sorry. He's in pain. Oh, it's still three star though. The poison one just takes a while. Oh. Poor thing. I thought it was already dead and then it started moving. Call our horse to us. I done scared everything in a way. No, no, I'm not. We're using all of its, uh, its meat and its uh, everything. We're gonna eat it. I didn't want it to suffer, so I hurried up and finished it off. 
I don't like hunting in real life. That's I, but we're we gonna uh, use it all. We're gonna sell the whole the whole thing to somebody to use. Yeah, yeah. In real life, it would be. Oh, you can't pick up a boar. What? I guess you can't. Just ask Wolverine. <laughs> Wolverine. Why well, Wolverine? That's cool, bro. <laughs> All right, I just need one boar. All right, I can. Let's see. Now I need a cow and a bull for one outfit, and that finishes the, the marauder outfit. That looks like that arrow just barely got him. It's like it's barely, like, through the front of his head. I'm like, oh man. I guess we got to find like some ranch, like farm thing to get the cow and the bull. Yeah. I don't know. I haven't seen cows or bulls that I know of. I don't think we can go straight into town and do it because we get in a lot of trouble there. Oh, he was shot with the... What? Shot, whoops. What? <laughs> what, is, what is that about? Is that? Uh, let's see. I don't even know where I would go for... Let's go and see if we can get this, the... Uh, Legendary uh, coyote while we're in the area. Actually, and then we can turn that in and just into the, to the trapper. Oh, it, it didn't even show up. <laughs> That's why I didn't see. That's blocked. <laughs> There's another one I need to put in, huh? Because that showed up with the number one there. I've tried. I've tried to put all the variations in. <laughs> I didn't think of that. So you can, you can pile all kinds of like pelts on the back of your horse as long as they're not the large animals. You can all kinds of medium ones. The wolverine, that dude shot the bear with a poison arrow, didn't finish it off and the wolverine got mad. Huh. Don't remember that. a buck. How close am I to the spot? Not that close. Yeah. Three star fox. Somewhere. I don't really need that one though. So we'll leave him alone. Yeah. So we had didn't have much luck with this coyote last time. There were like bounty hunters that kept showing up. They were about here, so we're gonna hitch the horse. I need to look up what 
I think for a coyote, I need the varmint rifle or the re repeater. Uh, so we're gonna take both of those and see. I think that should cover it. Repeater. Varmint rifle. That should cover us. Oh, it's a legendary animal. It don't matter. Actually, we don't. We don't have to get a perfect kill on it. Now I have to see if we can get those clues. See if those clo shoes, those clues show up at all for the legendary animal. Yeah, we need another Wolverine video game, huzzah. I would really love that. Heck, even a Lego one would be cool. Just, with just about Wolverine. Lego Wolverine. But preferably like a... Something like Insomniac did with Spider-Man. That would be cool. So it's, I gotta get a message that pops up on the screen saying I'm in legendary animal territory. I walked around this whole area like three times before. Marvel Contest of Champions. That's a that mobile game, right? <laughs> I've heard of that. Nah, it's alright. Although I did download a, a mobile Assassin's Creed game, but then the servers are down. There's a new Assassin's Creed game. I think it's called Assassin's Creed Rebellion. I was actually thinking about trying to get my phone hooked up to where I could stream it. I've got a crazy has a c cable that's like phone to HDMI but then the servers were down so I couldn't do that it actually looked kind of interesting it looks a little bit like Fallout Shelter but it's Assa Assassin's Creed from what I saw I haven't seen much about it there's the railroad tracks. That's not. It's not past them. Huh. This drove me nuts. Like the last stream before last. Well, who the hell is scaring everything off? It's my shooting. I think I can run. I don't know. I mean, I don't know if that's keeping it, will keep it, the clues from popping up if I'm running around. I, I really don't know what the deal is with Legendary. I've only done, one was a story mission, then I've found the Legendary Beaver. The bear was a story mission. That's the only two I've done. I see you, dear. I ain't got no beef with you today. Run along. Oh, come on. <laughs>
raspberry. Almost went a whole circle here. I'll get it. I never got a message saying I'm in legendary animal territory or anything. Yeah, there's my horse. I'm back to where I started. I could swear the first time I, f I found a clue, like, I don't know, around in here somewhere, like, alright, well, I'll, I'm gonna go to here, and then work my way down to here, I guess. And then if I still haven't seen it, we'll, we'll, just, we'll just give up, I guess. Oh, look, here we go. So now there's a clue somewhere. Oh. There we go. That's the legendary coyote, coyote dung. Okay then. Whoa, way ahead of me. <laughs> Where's the track? Oh, okay. That's it now. Now, we were doing this last time, and then all of a sudden bounty hunters were nearby, and it just stopped. What did he jump up for? Oh, there's the next clue. I see it. And I carry any more milkweed. Fur. If you say so, I don't see it. Oh, oh right there. I guess. I think the repeater is what you're supposed to use for coyotes, really, but it doesn't matter on this legendary one. What the heck is that right there? Oh, it's a vulture. Expect carcass the sheep. Right? Must be close. Oh, there it there it is.
Oh, come, oh, come on. Two shots didn't get it. Oh, sorry, fella. Oh, I feel bad doing that, really. Oh, but he was already dying. I don't feel as bad when it's one shot and then it's it's over. But oh, when they run off and they're injured though. So now we can make a coyote fang trinket and we turn this in the pelt into the trapper. Come here, Oreo. I need you, girl. There she comes. Oh, buzzards or something are already trying to get it. Off to the trapper. Mm, we'll probably do the ones out in the woods because I'm wanted dead or alive in St. Denis and I hate to lose all that stuff. I know you don't really lose the legendary one, just what our money would sell. But you keep the legendary parts. Like the trapper has, has them magically. You die. I don't want to lose my boar pelt. So. We'll go out to this trapper out in the woods. Hey, partner. Hey, partner. What was this I'm chasing? Is it just a rabbit? And we hunted for a whole day. It's already night time. Yeah. I'll turn in our pelts. And then go make that uh, coyote trinket. I'm not sure what it does. They give you some kind of stat boost. You have to take it, take the uh, coyote part to a fence. Actually, are we near one? Now we will probably have to sleep till morning. I don't think they're there at night. We might be able to do the fence on the way to the trapper. Yeah. Now, oh, but if I sleep though, the, the carcass, yeah. the the wolf, the coyote carcass, isn't gonna be any good. So never mind that. It'll rot and just like it'll just fall off my horse.
see if this will make sure this ain't make me run real roundabout or something. No. No, that's the way I need to go. Sometimes that route, it's like, doesn't take into account that you can, like, go across a stream and, the, and like, without a road. Things like that. Watch out, we don't get ambushed by those uh, Mufford brood. Yeah. We took their camp, and they're not too happy with us. So what is, what's everybody up to today? What are you up to, Huzzah? So? We got a little bit of a ride here. Oh, no, we're not. We're here. Okay. Oh! I just run over something. Chilling, watching bald eagles. Oh, in real life. Oh, that's poor. Cause I run it over. That's cool. Yeah, it won't take long, girl. So you got got a bunch in that area. That's all. to follow me. We got some roadkill here. We have to, want to sell it. They're not making that really cool eagle sound like they do on TV. Hey. <laughs> That's cool. There was an eagle or a hawk in this game that had come down and flew to a river and like picked up a snake and took off with it. Last chance to buy or sell. So, buying or selling. Right, let's see. Perfect boar pelt. Legendary coyote pelt. Legendary coyote carcass, 11 bucks. Boy, the things I can <laughs> make 90 with cents this. with poor fox pelt. Still carrying this. Uh, I didn't see that as a choice. Okay, let's take a look at it. Oh, there it is. I only get ninety cents for it. Mark off the uh, boar. Now for that outfit, I just need a cow and a bull. Accountable, I can get it back. Yeah. 
Did you see that? I brushed the horse and then magically the blood stains disappeared off its uh, back end from the way I was carrying the. You done good, that, uh, girl. That boar on the back of my horse. <laughs> yeah. All right, some kind of ranch or something. Maybe where I could find a. Oh no, let's do the. We could do the fishing thing. I was talking about. Uh, I guess it. Um, where was it? It's up at a pond somewhere. Maybe it's gotta be daytime. Let's camp. Easy. Probably make us something to eat here too. Before we head off. Have one more. Plain roasted pork. <coughs> I think when he starts coughing, that means that's all I can eat. Yeah. Hey, thanks, uh, was that? Yeah, that was a uh, crazy. Put the put the words on there. Yeah. Set it up. You did a pretty good job. I like I like it. One of three oh horsemen. One of three obstacles jumped in fifteen seconds. <laughs> be the same object <laughs> yep. yeah. Ah. yeah yeah that's the one we took at the end string yeah all right I'm gonna get this little horseman challenge now <laughs> I gotta jump over three things. See if we can do it without hurting a horse. So. Hey, there we got it. Yeah. Alright. Jumping rocks. <laughs> Fences probably would have made it easier if I just found some horses. Ride from Valentine to Rhodes in less than five minutes. So from here to here. Does it discount once you start once you officially leave Ro Valentine or something? Eh, I'll do it another time. There's the fishing guy. Hamish Sinclair. That's where we're heading. There's like a hundred different challenges, but you'd only unlock them once you do one of the challenges in the list. Like, uh, you can't just do all of them whenever. There's, 
bandit challenges, exploring challenges, uh, herbalist challenge, sharpshooter challenges, and several other count. Hunter, I think a hunter is one of them, master hunter. Yeah, that's what, when I took that picture yesterday, that's kind of what I had in mind. I was wanting to do a new, Ar Arthur's new look and make it a thumbnail. Investigating. Oh, man. Can't you get me off this thing? What witness? What are they talking about? Hey, friend. Why are you carrying me? Huh? <laughs> Why are you carrying me? Huh? Oh! <laughs> I like how he just throws them down. Hey, friend. You do me a kindness and untie me. Ah, hell, there's a witness getting away. Jesus, thank you. They had me mixed up with my brother. I don't got no money. Uh. But the Valentine <laughs> doctor does. Something shady going on in his shop out here. Valentine doctor's got something shady. I heard something about this. Let's get out of here. <laughs> That's the way I need to go, really. Dang. We're going to find a way around. Uh, let's head off that way. If we can. Oh, hell. I got bounty hunters over that way, too. Yeah, we got a new route. Here we go. See, nothing come of that. There was like an invest witness of the murder, but we didn't stick around, so it didn't add a new bounty to us. have a death wish going right in front of you. Well, I guess that's true in real life too. Hey, what's this? The ram. I don't need another ram. I need a goat. Oh dang, <laughs> big old ram just right in front of me. That one I was just looking at. Okay then. Can we go down this hill?
It's looking a bit steep right there, but maybe where we're going down it'd be okay. <laughs> that actually made me nervous. <laughs> Yeah, there's this cabin. There's like that veteran's cabin. Oh, is that a goat? Oh, it's a sheep. I think there's some stuff you can use sheep for, but I don't need them for the outfits I'm going for right now. Right, let's take a bath here, girl. house or the shed I think that's just a shed yeah nope nope not carrying again the there's a, there's the horse we had to chase after Buell Carmelo gold I like that horse said we might go out fishing. Don't take much persuading to get me to go fishing. Let's go to my boat. Good. Here she is. You mind rowing? Sure. Sure. What are we fishing for? Yeah. Only one thing worth catching in this lake. The great tyrant. Great tyrant. Oh. <laughs> mean as hell, Northern Pike. Eats everything else that spawns around here, its own kind included. Well, is that our bait then? A jack or something? Hell no. He's a clever old <laughs> bastard. I made these. This one's mine. You're gonna have to spare. They are pretty. You don't know the half of it. <laughs> Come on, let's push you off. Got a new lore. I'll show you where we're rowing to. Take us over there to the right. We'll set up ten yards or so offshore. There's a special lure handbill. Now you won't let me look at it right now. Oh. He don't keep far away from me, the tyrant. Wants me to know whose lake it is. We'll show him who's boss. <laughs> the optimism of youth. Right here. We'll cast off towards the island. Okay. You got that lure I gave you? Get special lake lure. Grab. Spent years working on that. Finding the right combination of feathers, twine, and glimmer. Making them, losing them, getting them right. Tried coins, shell cases, even a medal. Finally found something he seems to like. But now I hear you can buy him in a shop. Well, it wouldn't be quite so satisfying. Getting him with something shop bought. Easy for you to say. <laughs> but maybe I'm inclined to agree. Come on, fish. Whoa, what's this? Well, you got something? Oh, he's got something. I got something, all right. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, hey, him. Hey, you need Come on now, Tyrant. I got you. I got you. Come on. I went all slack. 
your leg, man. Yeah, he does. You lost anything? It's just my rod. We got my toes, too. They weren't wooden. You want another go at him? I still got my lure. Nah. He's your fish now. Cast away. Now we gotta rotate to that spot. Oh, okay. We'll come at him from the other way. Row over there. When he bumped me, I had to check twice. Thought I'd find a chunk of uh -huh. me missing. Man eating pie? That would be a first. I'm not so <laughs> sure. Okay, right here. Our hopes of catching this bastard lie with you. Cash back to where we were, and make sure to use that lure I gave you. So we'll probably get it here. It's, it was scripted, so I wasn't going to catch anything. Come on! I think I hooked him! Real! Let's land the bastard! Whoa! Bring it in now. Come on. Don't let him pull you. Yes. Start reeling. A real man here. Dang. That's a monster fish. Dang. <laughs> I think you got him, man. That's <laughs> personal, bro. Arthur looks like he's gonna pass out. Let's row back. Here, here. Oh, the holder. Pass me the tyrant. That is if you're sure you don't want him. Oh, oh, big old I ain't poach from your pond. Well, I'll give him his honors then. He sure was something, huh? <laughs> he was. <clears throat> Thanks for taking me out. I appreciate the company. That's one hell of a one fish. Hell of a fish. <laughs> Ain't he something? <laughs> so long. Hey, you ever want to go out hunting? You stop by again. I may. Ooh, we're gonna go hunting with him sometime. We're gonna go hunt. There's gonna be another legendary animal. Let's take his horse. <laughs> Let's see what else we can catch in this water here. Like.
What the heck? It like lagged, and all of a sudden it didn't cast. Anything by now, wonder. Let's see if we can catch a fish to cook here. Just jumping over here. Let's go over there. There we go. That's it, I think. Yes. Come on, fish. What we got here? Four pound salmon. Maybe we'll quit there. That's enough. Can break down the fish? the heck do we get if we do that? Oh, it just turns it into the meat. Oh, okay. Some succulent fish meat. <laughs> I like fish. I haven't had fish in a while. What? Some health care, I see. It doesn't actually store the, show the liquid pouring out. As much detail as they have, I'm surprised it doesn't. Potent Miracle Tonic. Some more split point repeater cartridges. Uh, do a few of those. So you'd use less dead eye. You could do them one at a time though. It takes a little while. So we won't do but maybe like a dozen or something like that. Need some more cover scent. I've been using that up for when I go hunting. Go do I guess I'll do another story mission now. You all right, girl? Yep, Sadie back at camp here.
That's my girl. So we've been horsing around here, <laughs> doing uh, hunting and fishing and stuff. We'll do some more story. Yeah. Hey, Gaza, you still here? better at riding my horse here. I don't have as many accidents. I mean, I never had a whole lot of accidents, but I've been pretty good at avoiding trees and rocks and stuff most of the time. I hear an eagle or a hawk. That's it, man. Two of them. Ten good shooting, senor. Thank God for you, mister. Le devo la vida. You're welcome, sir. Oh, no! Don't, don't freak him out. Start shooting, daddy. Good luck with it. Que alivio. <laughs> we actually made it in time. Save somebody. Usually I'm too late, and this says takes away honor. I didn't get honor for saving him, though. I don't think. <laughs> Poor wolf pelt. There's no sense even getting the other one. That gives me like 90 cents. I got all like the fat meat I can get off of the first one. Could be on the lookout for another ambush as we go back to camp. They like to to do that. Like every stage of the game seems like whatever gang I'm is in the area, they'll have little ambushes. Another one? Oh, it's just that guy in the water. The mad preacher. Stop staring me. We well, well, talked to him before. So he keeps doing that? He's just crazy. There's nothing we can do. <laughs> he just talks for a minute and then goes lays down by the river. Goes to sleep. Them Butcher Creek people. Hey, who's that? Arthur. Roll out the Roll out the yeah, Arthur's back. Boy. Oh, I run him into the tent. I need to stay there. He'll go over and hang out with the other horses. What other missions do we have? This is that's the one I'm doing. I'm just wondering what what else is on the map. 
Oh, Eagle Flats. Some more stuff with him. The Native American leader, the chief. Oh, Sadie's way up that way. The Reverend left Arthur. Where'd he go? I, I don't know. He left me a note. Told Everybody's me leaving. I should he probably should. Why? Well, I think he's worried. <laughs> he's a right to be worried. You worried? Sure, but I still think maybe things will turn out okay. You, you'll steer Dutch right. I know yeah, I you that's no way. I'll try, Miss Grimshaw. <laughs> really, I will. Hey there. There's Mary Beth. How are you doing? This place, it's horrible. Have you seen inside that cave? No. Oh. I know. It's only for now. Hang in <laughs> <It's>, uh, <laughs> okay, Arthur. Uh, crazy is, uh... Got, she's not here. She had to work. Things are gonna be okay. And Jack. welcome back. Can I go play in the caves? No, I ain't safe in there. Well, I suppose I should be getting off. Okay. I don't like Jack's voice. It's weird. Oh, he's going to do a mission. Nope, 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 Mr. Nope, Morgan. Nope. nope. <laughs> I don't want to do his. Keep your eyes peeled, Marston. Arthur? Really feels like it's splitting into two sides here. I know. Well, just keep your ear to the ground. Take care. Hey, so Jose, do you, uh, what have you been up? Uh, oh, I mean, I meant to say that's the wrong question. Jeez. Oh, she's practicing throwing knives to the tree. So, Huzzah, what do you got planned for Thanksgiving? Mrs. Ed. You okay? Peach. So what are you doing for Thanksgiving, sure? Huzzah? No, I ain't sure. You still working? Is anybody still working? The whole goddamn place full of people. Bickering. Fighting and lying. It makes me real sad. I know. I need someone to ride with me. Do what? Finish off them of Driscoll's. I hear the last of them is holed up at Hanging Dog Ranch. She wants her revenge. Me no more. The so Same thing you always do. <laughs> have some. I just don't care. Have some turkey. I was a married woman. You know what they did to me and to my husband. Like you're the only one of these fools that I trust. I've got to do this. Oh, you can not help her? I'll help her. I'll tell you what. I'll do it. But this oh, maximum honor. Alright. Abigail. Jack. John. Make sure they make it. I mean, this whole thing is pretty much done. But when the time comes... Or how do you mean? When the time comes, you help them. What do you mean? I mean, help them escape when I... We're more ghosts than people, but them, they, they could. I know. They're a family. Of course I will. Thank you, Arthur. You want to ride with me now, or meet me up at Hanging Dog Ranch when you can? <whistles> Thanks, Go Arthur. Go right out. Okay, come on. Roll out. <clears throat>
Yeah, we're not doing too much. I have like a little dinner. There's some turkey and stuff. I'm not sure if my parents are wanting to do anything this year or not. For killing. Huh. Hey. You seen anything down there? Yeah, I think there's a bunch of them down there. I'm mostly drunk. For one of them, it's a fat <laughs> fellow with a beard. Him? He's mine. Okay. Fat fellow with the beard? <laughs> it's a big rifle. What do I got on me? Just the varmint rifle? Oh, come on, wait. Bench. Run down. Lots of folk there. But spread pretty thin. I'll set it off yeah. and we'll, yeah. we'll take it from there. Take it from there? Okay. It's filled with Peter. So, no real plan then. Come Hang on, up, Sadie. Come on. Now come on. Now him. Is that a woman? Jesus. Who the hell is that? No, I don't really uh, want like him. The lady from the hanging. Dang, she's doing a Molotov in the house. Wait for me, Sandy. Dang it. I climb up on the rock. <laughs> Damn. Damn, she set some bastards on fire there. She's out for blood. Get some logistics. They killed her husband. And the salt is there. <laughs> he's fat and he's got a beard. He's mine. Oh, I need to make sure I got.
Well, let me go any faster. Every day, every moment, uh, they turn me into a monster, Arthur. But my memories of him, they still pure. No, I ain't even got that. Aside from my Jake, you're the best man I've known. I know the company you keep. The competition ain't too fierce. <laughs> we, uh... We should get away from her. Yeah. Oh, come on. I wanted to loot them. This game don't allow you to like you looting people that, all that often. <laughs> I think I need to be alone for a bit. I understand. You, uh, I want to get yourself cleaned up. Thank you, Arthur. Well, maybe they'll let me stay here and loot. I have to watch out for more, like, the law showing up or something. Secure the barn without taking any damage. I didn't realize my data was out. I probably could have done that. That won't be too bad one to replay. I don't think. You have discovered a gang hideout. That thing is still burning. She's setting some fools on fire. Oh, there is something going on nearby. Ah, freaking bounty hunters. Let's see what's in the house. Let's see like any of those collector cards or something. People probably don't have much of anything on them. Oh, there's yeah, premium cigarettes. That's got the collect cards. I have to get rid of like one cigarette. Amazing inventions, dynamite card six twelve found. We're going to make a run for it pretty soon, <laughs> unless we want to have a shootout with the bounty hunters. Oh, cigarette card. There we go. Bart Love. Famous gunslinger. Oh dang, he's missing a leg. Oh, I'm not missing it. It's like right over there. But <laughs>
we just like, take him out? Damn. Yeah, they don't like you staying around looting. You really got like, to script it for like bounty hunters or the law to show up you know, after all these missions, pretty much. I'm kind of getting used to that. At first, I was like, what? I need to loot all these people. And now I'm just like, okay. mission at the moment. Let's see, what, what should we do? The little white things aren't showing up either. Maybe because that bounty hunter nearby? Yeah. Oh, he's still on us here. Let's get... Pull out a better weapon. And turn around here and just pick him off. See ya, bounty hunter. Yeah. Worm food now. Well, that's what it was. Now the Eagle Flats mission shows up. Um, anything nearby? No, not really. I guess we're going on the story here. We'll do the Eagle Flies. Dutch has convinced Eagle Flies to take action against the military. Oh no. That's not going to go well. Damn it, Dutch. Sometimes it's a delayed for that you scare the animals off. That deer should have just like run. It's still standing there. Yep. There we go. Somebody heard the sheep. Sheep dog here with him. Hey there, mister. Hey there, mister. Oh, we got an open mail. We can start and get some mail.
Howdy, y'all. How do you do? Welcome. How do you do? Letter from Charles Chardonnay arrived 15 days ago. <laughs> oh, dear. Have you come down with the flu as well, sir? Flu? No. What are you talking about? Nothing. It's just been going around, that's all. Anyway, how can I help you? And that's it. I got my mail. Monsieur, oh, that's that artist, weird art, French artist guy. Was always getting into trouble. Hard to believe it. Monsieur and me, I made it. I had the sun on my face, sand between my toes, and a beautiful bohemian in my bed. The islands are everything I thought they would be. How extraordinary! Uh, I'm here. If you need a bit of help. You did not ask for anything. You only gave. How perfect, perfect, how rare. I detest selfish asses more than civilization itself. Before I sent this, I shipped some ca canvases to New York to be sold. Perhaps if you own that little scribble, it may be worth something now. Either that or laugh at my ineptitude. Always yours, CC. Between you and me? Where you find a station, you'll find a lot of trouble. Yeah, we sent him off on a boat. He... Thanks, Mister. Hey. Hello there. And, uh, he was made to fight off some guys so he could get away. <gasps> I was hitting the wrong button. Why is it saying I still have something there? Oh, well. I'm doing too much damage. <laughs> With the eagle flies. It's gonna be a crazy mission, I'm sure. find out where like I could get a cow and a bull hide. Got, there's a lot of animals in this game. Huh? I wonder if it's accurate how many there are, because I know there's not as much civilization. So there's animals. Trying to build a house and attack me. Appreciate you stepping in there. 
Those bastards been turning the screw on me from day one, saying I gotta pay them protection money. I told oh, them where to stick it, and uh, it, I guess you just saw how that panned out. You watch yourself, all right? Stay out of trouble. I'll try. Stay out of trouble. Oh, little boy here, there was. What happened to you two? Scared. Like dogs. You wouldn't give us no guns, Pa. This is the worst idea I've ever had. Curtis. We're with you on that. Thank you, Curtis. Why don't you help out? Hey, watch it. Are you crazy? No. <laughs> you teach us to shoot instead of building a stupid house. I'll be taking that, sir. Good luck with your house there, sir. I'm supposed to get a suit for getting Max on or I wonder where I go, just like the little general store? Or what? Flies here. Whoa, easy. I closed the mission where I can't, where there was bounty hunters. I gotta wait a second or something. Biscuits. <coughs> All right, not good. 
Come on. Why is it still locked? I took care of the bounty hunters. I guess I have to walk away, go away a little bit, and come back. Man, camp. Can I say I can't when you've recently committed a crime? Gotta leave the area and come back. Alright. I wonder how far I had to go. Oh, it's, it's split back up. It wasn't far at all. <laughs> what was the point of that? What's going on? Rebellion, the smell of cordite and integrity. It is a beautiful thing. What are you all doing? An eye for an eye. We didn't start this, Arthur. They did. We? This ain't our fat. It surely is. Whatever it is you're planning, it ain't a good idea. They want you to fight. Nobody will be killed. We're just gonna trap a few of them in the valley, disarm them, tar and feather them, no, and remind okay. them to leave these boys alone. You have energy for pranks? Come on, Arthur. Just tweaking Uncle Sam's nose <laughs> a little. I need you to help me. Are you crazy, Dutch? Besides, it's perfect. People will see these boys, they won't notice us, and they'll think we're gone. <laughs> Everyone will blame everything on the Indian problem, and we'll disappear up the river. But first, we need to trap them in this pass. Help me dynamite up these trees. So, you're using them? No, sir. <laughs> no, never. But... It is mutually beneficial to draw attention to one problem and avail over another. These are good people, but their situation is real complex. We ain't helping them. Sure we are. Come on, let's get this done. Some trees, huh? I sent for some of that dynamite you and Bill commandeered in Van Horn. Good work with that, by the way. Bill played drunk. The perfect man for uh -huh. the job. Open up the dynamite. So, you finally got to see Colm Hank. Yeah. After all those years, hard to believe. Oh, but it was worth the wait. See? We're tying up the loose ends, horses, one by one. I think that should 
do it. Come on now, quick. Get back up here. Okay, let's go, Arthur. My spotter will let us know when they're near. They're coming now. God damn. The patrol's a lot larger than we thought it was gonna be. <laughs> Don't worry. That's a good thing. Okay, that's the signal. Here they come. Stay low and quiet. You sure you don't want me to man that plunger, Arthur? No, I got it. Oh, remove the weight of the world from your shoulders for a minute. Like I said, we're just going to give them a bit of a scare. There they are. Looks like more than we thought. It's fine. We're only here to talk <laughs> and administer a little good old-fashioned humiliation. You're owed that, son, at the very least. Wait for my lead, men. Everyone just stay calm. We've got the upper hand here. Okay, they've passed the first charge. How exactly the few trees Put your hands on? up. You surrounded. Nobody need get hurt. Your humiliation of us has gone on quite enough. This ain't a good idea. Put down your guns. You are making a mistake, boy. No, you're making a mistake. Put your hands up, soldier. Take a little humiliation and leave these fine folks alone. Who are you? A concerned citizen. Is that so? What now? We should move. No, 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 not quite yet. Soldier, you and your friends gonna tuck tail and run off? Run! Excuse me? I'm getting bored of this. Your friends fired first, soldier! <laughs> I don't want to do that for us. That's all I got, though. There's a lot of them. There's another patrol in the rear. Looks like we got a fight, man, boy. I think I'm doing that. This is way too much. Hold your ground. This time you pay for what you Look out. You pushed us. I'm going to try to switch to my revolver. I can do better now. Chefs and bullies. Watch your goddamn mouth. All of you, take what you can, and then we move out. Move now. We have to move now. Search these men quickly, then we move. This is crazy. Why aren't we getting <laughs> out of here? They might have information on them that'll help our friends with their cause. We need anything my father can use to strengthen our case. I ain't sure much is going to strengthen your case after this. Find anything? Yes. Some poor fool from New Jersey. These boys ain't the problem. They're only kids. 
Keep looking. Damn. Shit! Everyone, keep your heads down. Well, they're sending riders from the fort we need to leave. But where's Peter? Was he killed? He's alive. Well, that went just about according <laughs> to plan. I'm trying. I'm trying, Arthur, with everything I have, and I will keep trying, and you'll keep doubting me, and we'll keep failing. It ain't like that, Dutch. Look at me. Look at me! I'm just... I'm worried about folk. I know. I... We should go. Where's Eagle Flash? Run, son! Run! Come on! This area is gonna be crawling with soldiers in a few minutes. We gotta leave. Now! Now? What about Eagle Flash? We gotta go, Arthur. Come on! Dang. That's all we have for himself. We need to ride hard. Stay with me. Fill up my dead eye core. Left here, into the trees. <laughs> okay, let's dismount here. We won't get the horses down this path. All right, let's carry on by foot. Try and sell them a little snake oil. You think? It's all I got. Get out of here. Gah! Yeah. Let's see if we can lose him down here. Go, go. Shit. I guess not. <laughs> behind something harder. We're gonna win this.
Und jetzt versuche ich mal hoffen. Dead in. Well, Horser. Put your hands up. I said put your damn hands up. Okay. Okay. Follow my lead. I got a plan. This is a good one. <laughs> this is a good one. Hello, officers. You keep them hands up and come here. Put your hands up. Hello, Captain. Keep your hands up and come here. Come here. We, uh, we can't do that. It's over jumping, huh? Those men they killed? They were good men. You're fighting nature, Captain. Get over here! Ask my friend here. My whole life, I tried to fight change. It's a waste. I see that now. It's waste. You can't fight. You're pulling a fugitive nature, here, Captain. Jumping off into the water. You can't fight change. You can't fight gravity. <laughs> oh no, my hat. How's he so far ahead of me? Dutch, I lost my hat. We gotta find it. from chaos eagle flies must have been taken taken or killed well we can't go find out no not now charles i'll we'll send them uh, where is it? <coughs> he's probably back at camp let's split up i'll go tell him you rest up then go meet him up at the reservation we are gonna make it brother i can feel <laughs> it Faith, Arthur. Full of crap, Dutch. Have faith. Have faith. We just need a little more time and some more money. And we'll make it. Kill the soldier on the cannon within 45 seconds. Get 35 headshots. Another Molotov here. All right, what now? There's Oreo. 
been a while, girl. I like that one. Yep. We're getting near the end of this story. Right, it's a Charles mission up in the, the reservation. We should be able to follow this train track. The train tracks. Another legendary animal here. The wolf. So up now. Yeah, we'll do that another time. I just happened to see the clue while I'm driving here. We never made that trinket either. I gotta do that sometime. Make sure we're going the right way. Hello, Charles. Thank you for coming. Of course. The chief, he's, uh, he's very... Maybe you could speak to him? Yes, that's why I came. He's in his tent. Sure. I'll wait for you sure. here. <laughs> yeah, I like that hat, yeah. It's like, that's the gambler outfit. Mr. Morgan, I'm so glad you could make it. How are you? <laughs> my son. My son is foolish, but he's still my son. I know your son. A little. Uh, he 
He's very brave. Very angry. <laughs> He's me. How is your father? He's dead a long time. He uh, lived a lot longer than was good for any of us. My son probably wishes the same to me. <laughs> he almost sounds like Leonard Nimoy. I doubt that. I want peace. I need my people to be safe. All my life I've tried to bring peace. But I love my son. They'll hang him for treason. Treason. Oh yeah, it's always He's growing. He's the chief huh? son of a proud nation. How could he commit treason? People who have lied to my people for a hundred years or more. That's treason. Well. What should I do? I don't think there's much chance reasoning with Colonel Favor. No. And any chance we had, your friend, Mr. Vanderland, has ensured relations between us and the army are worse than any point in the last five years. I'm sure he means well. But matters are more complex than he understands. Me and Charles will try and rescue your son. No. Yes, yes. I ain't got much to lose, and you got... I'm doing this. Charles! Where are you? Come on, let's go. We need to get his son back, of course. I just ain't sure how. I've been working on that. I think there's a way. Follow me. We gotta go rescue Eagle. Eagle flies. And we got similar tastes in horses there, Charles. Got half white in spots. Yeah, this outfit was just one I bought at the ta the tailor in uh, Saint Denis. So, I've been scouting the fort. The army are patrolling all the main roads and bridges in and out. But if we can get the horses across the river, I found a route that should get us in fairly close. If we wait until late enough, there's a place we should be able to sneak in around the back. Okay, whatever you think, I trust you. No guns, just knives and arrows. If we start making a lot of noise. He'll be dead before we get close to him. Okay. I left two canoes down river in case we need another way out of there. Okay, good. <coughs> you know, this wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for Dutch. It ain't just on Dutch. We all went along with it. He saw Eagle Flies burn hot, and he fanned the flames. He's not helping that tribe, he's helping himself. You see that, or you wouldn't have gone to Rain's fall behind his back. I guess I just keep thinking. There must be a way to save the situation. Pull Dutch out of the place he's in. Well, I like Rain's fall. I don't know, Arthur. Rain's fall is in a tough situation, and that's for Dutch. <sighs> I gotta try. I own that at least. You feel that? There's rain on the wind. I know. Listen, Charles. If it goes bad in there, you get yourself out. You got more to lose. No. Come on. Don't start talking like that. Uh, I didn't tell well, that you. That horse was awful close to that edge. I saw a doctor. It's pretty bad. It's gonna get worse. Oh, Arthur. Well, it's pretty. Any day we can die. Hmm? We're riding to break an Indian chief's son out of a cavalry fort. We could both die tonight. In a way, it is a gift to know. In a way, you are lucky. Sure don't feel like that. You still have time to make amends. The others, Hosea, Lenny, Sean, all them. They oh, didn't. Poor Lenny. And what about the calendar boys? Both killed trying to escape Blackwater? A more vicious pair of bastards than ever was. And that's all they ever were and will be. Oh yeah, that's all I'm saying, huh? Oh. Maybe. You're lucky. You got the chance. We got similar tastes in horses here. <laughs> to do something better. My guess is maybe that's why you're here now. Either way, 
Just keep your head strong. We're close now. No. Oh yeah, he got gunned down. His uh. Are you all right? Yeah, I think so. That current's strong. Up here. Follow me. Uh, back during that uh. You were right about the bank mess up in Saint Denis. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's stupid Dutch. But might help us with sneaking in there. The rainsfall told me there was some retaliation after the meeting with Colonel Favors. Some women were taken. Elders beaten. Bastards. Yeah. This isn't gonna be nice. There it is. Fine. Let's get ourselves hidden and wait till it gets dark. Over here. A military fort here, huh? I guess this is it. I guess it is. Let's keep quiet. And try and find our way in. Main thing is that they don't hear us. You ready? Control group. Hopefully we'll be in and out before they can come back around. There's two guards out front. If you take one, I'll take the other. Nice and quiet. Are you getting in the way, Charles? Now, come on. Okay, come on. Let's see if we can get her on the back. Stay close to the wall. There's a guard right above us. It's like I don't think it's seen them. Saw the lantern light. Yeah, poor Lenny. His uh, I like Lenny too. Okay, come on. Wait. Oh, oh, oh. We got two more ahead. Dang, Arthur. One down here, one up in the tower. Let's take one each again. Nice, Charles. Okay. Uh, thank you. Come on. Around the back. And he even knows which one I'm pointing at. He knows to get the other. This is the spot. Switch hats, that's my disguise. Shot on that guy. <laughs> so I supposed to say no? I don't get it. <laughs> what are you doing, Arthur? I'll never get him out now. There's a guard coming. Yeah, well, I was supposed to get him fast, I guess. Shit. No. 
another guard on the walkway. Are you taking him? No need to waste an arrow on him. Use your knife. You deal with this one. Yeah, you do right. some work here, Charles. Okay, let's move. I'm hot. Another two ahead. One each. Same as before. Up. Oh. Quick, Arthur. <laughs> Dang. You're supposed to come up here with me. Why wouldn't you come up here with your knife too? That was dumb. That should have worked. If he come up here with me with his knife. And we stabbed them both same time. Ah. That was dumb. Another one up ahead. Oh, 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 I thought it was an eye. Are you taking Hold on. No need to waste an arrow on him. Use your knife. You go, Charles. Sure. Bam, right in the back of the head. Done. Oh. Let's go. Lay there, Charles. Wait. I'll make sure the tower is clear. It's okay. Let's go. There's a guard out front. You take him. I'll cover back there. All right. Try to put an arrow into the lantern above that stack of wood over there. Start a fire. We should have a clear shot from the walkway up there. Oh! oh. <laughs> I'm supposed to shoot him with the arrow, I guess. That is a trick point anyway. Cards. Get up that tower and try to distract them. Oh, 
Oh. Look for the keys. You have to get me out of here. God. Charles is a badass. Come on. Your father sent us. My father. He told you to come and kill guards? No, he didn't say that. He... Of course not. You okay? Sure. Enjoy being tortured. Clears the mind. Huh. If you say so. Huh. Whoa, whoa. Uh. I'm fine. I'm fine. All right, now we got to shoot our way out. Damn it! We'll have to shoot our way out. Well, I just say. Oh, there we go. I'm all three of me. Feels like they're me. Come on, move up. Two, 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 yeah. Watch yourselves, more up ahead. I got the elbow. <laughs> he wants me to use a cannon. <laughs> right, I made my own hole. We didn't need no stinking cannon. Here, come on. Get on. I didn't mean to do that, actually. It worked. Oh, no, I didn't kill him. This way, come on. I hit some canoes down by the river. I got my bow. No, not the bow. Ooh, the lightning. That was cool. What the heck? My core's already gone? That's the, one the, the bad guy who was on me. I thought that was, uh, you know. That's the dead one.
Well, that's pretty fun. Let's get down river as quick as we can. Don't pay for this. No wish they killed me when they had a chance. Let's just get you to safety first, my friend. Like Dutch said, they only have power and they're allowed to have it. Dutch says a lot of things. This is so swell. Watch yourself. Last time. I can't see that. Huh? You won't let me. Along for the ride, they wouldn't let me shoot. Because I was too busy with the canoe. I think we lost them. Come on. <coughs> you okay, Arthur? Yeah, I'm right as rain. How are you? <clears throat> I'll be fine in a day or so. I heal fast. Colonel Favors won't be too happy. For your rescue. I guess not. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot more trouble. My father. Even he may have to fight. You won't win. No big fight with them. Shouldn't y'all just run away? Where would we go? I don't know. In front. Let me take you back to your father. Hmm? <sighs> Thank you. No mention. <sighs> Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing. While infiltrating Fort Wallace, headshot every soldier blocking your way to Eagle Flies. Kill 15 enemies while escaping in the canoe. It wouldn't let me shoot. What do I need to hit? Got done, got down the river. We, we saved eagle flies and escaped in these canoes. Evidently, I could shoot in the canoes, but that was one of the little checkpoint things, checklist things for gold. But yeah, I'm not sure why I needed to hit. I was paddling in the canoe and they couldn't port my guns. Uh, I need a warmer outfit on. I got a smart horse if he knows where I'm at before I went down the river like that. <laughs> Come on, girl. Yeah. Alright, I'm not sure what we're doing now. I got about 15 minutes before I need to wrap up. Uh, so we probably don't have time for this Dutch mission. Dutch needs to speak to you. There's that one guy that we had to, like, had to interview these famous gunslingers. <laughs> Yeah, 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 something like that is a uh, 
<laughs> Let's go check out him, this gunslinger. I have I had one left I haven't done. Hey Hassan. How are you doing? Just got through the cool mission where I had to we saved uh Oh, oh my gosh. Sorry, Oreo. I was not paying attention. Yeah, that's good. So we just saved the, the Native American chief's son out of the fort. He was held prisoner. Because a bunch of craziness Dutch was doing. Is that the same? Is this is that the same Hassan? Yeah, I know. I remember Hassan from Injustice too. No. I didn't think that was his YouTube name, but he came in the. Uh, There's a different YouTube name username. How's, uh, so what are you up to today, Hassan? Oh, you're just asking if I remembered him. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was trying to read that real quick and watch what I'm doing. Ah, uh, okay. Sorry about that. I misread what uh, Hassan was saying. It's snowing up here. snow much lately. This is the first time I've returned to a snowy area in a while. <laughs> Killed the legendary uh, Chevy Silverado. <laughs> oh, you're silly as I. Planet on the PS3, you hear the Quran in the game? Huh. Now, I, would, I played some of Little Big Planet, but uh, mainly my son played a lot of that game. I played that with him a little bit. Yeah, that's cool though. That's cool, huh? Look at rabbits running through the snow. Slow down a little Hold bit up. here before I run off this edge. Uh, no, I'm not a big FIFA player, Hassan, or, or P, uh, PES. I only like the. Uh, let's see, what sports games did I like? I, there's not a lot of them. It's like baseball, it's kind of fun. MLB, the show. I never liked the. Like the Foot, uh, football games either or basketball ones some of the hockey games are pretty fun but there's not very many sports games I actually play I've tried out some of like the WWE games I, I don't like them at all <laughs> I'm just naming a bunch of different uh, sports things now Sheep. 
All my health core is empty. Let's fix that. Is it saying I'm not wearing a warm outfit and it's too cold here? Or what? My satchel. I should have something to fill up my cores a little better. There we go. Well, I'm sick. They just drain. The health cores drain faster. Where Arthur's sick here. So you play a lot of FIFA, Hassan? Or do you like the other? Yep. I've forgotten how pretty the snow looked like from the beginning of the game. the wrong way, sort of. <laughs> this gunslinger is way out here. That's why I haven't done this last one. Just want to speak to Hernandez. We don't take two visitors up here. Kill this uh -oh. fool! Ah! Dang, he's right in front of me, too. I don't see how I'm dead. <laughs> Take that hat, sir. Blacko Hernandez. Thank you. <laughs> you in there? I didn't want trouble, but I'm just here to speak with you about Boy Calloway. <laughs> That's a heck of a lot. I guess he's many as not old. That's different. I just want to talk. My boy Callaway. Uh, here's your message. Oh my god. I... <laughs> Dang. Here's your message. And I didn't do it right. Oh. I don't like, I don't, I haven't done the draw mechanic all that often. I still get confused about how, what they want to 
kind of it's not really giving me the time to do it. The, the draw, the quick, regular dead eye would be better. But it's some kind of dual mechanic here. You slowly hit the right trigger. Am I shooting him in the arm? Killed him? Now I gotta just take a picture of it. <laughs> now, why am I turned around this way? I didn't like that photo? What? It wasn't close up enough? What? Let's do it again. I guess. They didn't like my picture. I was going for an artistic shot and I did a close up thing. I mean. <laughs> Let's take his, can we get and take his hat? I lost all my hats. Where's my hat? That's a ratty old hat. <laughs> so, that wasn't very uneventful for my last mission there. Really. Yeah, I found one. Look, it's this ugly thing. <laughs> Let's get the... Uh, Yeah, the head is ugly. <laughs> We're gonna take another picture here. Looks like an old witch hat. Yeah. <laughs> Wrong button. How come? Uh, let's see. I'm blocking. A lot of what I wanted in the picture this way. I was wanting the frozen water there. I'm going to have to move. But I don't want me to be in it. Let's, see. Let's just go over here. And then we'll take a pic another picture here I might use for another thumbnail. And then we're going to wrap up. It's about 5.30. something I guess oh he's clipping through the hat I don't know you don't want that one oh, yeah it's good enough I don't know if it'll be good enough for a thumbnail or not let's see I wonder if you can fall through the ice.
Probably not. Keep your dreams... <laughs> okay. Keep your dreams simple. Why is that carved into the ice? Health core is empty again because it's so cold up here. That was weird. Sheep and ram. I need a goat somewhere. I don't know where where to get them exactly. Yeah. All right, guys. I guess that's it. I'm gonna wrap up here. Thanks everybody for watching. And thank you, Hazan. Huzzah. Huzzah. Anybody else that happens to be watching? Appreciate it, guys. I'll see you next time, uh, probably for a little while tomorrow. Probably, probably get. I'll probably get stream tomorrow. Let's go have snow pop off the with limbs. I'm out of here. See you guys next time.